ML Sports Take here brought to you by Welch and Company Jewelers and the Syracuse Fitness Store. The Cincinnati Bengals are marching on to the AFC Championship game. What a game that was. Boy, the NFL is king, isn't it? And it's a king that has an indefinite spot on the throne because this theater, the end of the games, crazy drama. What an unbelievable job by Cincinnati. They had coughed up the lead. And, of course, Tennessee uh, threw back a little bit of the medicine uh, the other way. They pick off Joe Burrow questionable INT. I didn't like the call because the ball was on the ground, but they didn't reverse it. Cincinnati, though, uh, after 16-16, they battled back. Then another pick happens again. Tannehill throws into a kind of a chaotic one-on-one -on -one, uh, situation. Gr great play by the secondary man, but still a very risky throw. And that's the difference. Ryan Tannehill is not Joe Burrow. Ryan Tannehill is not Josh Allen, Patrick Mahomes, uh, Aaron Rodgers. Uh, he's not any of these guys. Uh, Russell Wilson. And uh, and that's why the Tennessee Titans, in my opinion, won't get to a Super Bowl until they get an elite quarterback. You can have a great regular season. You can win a bunch of games. You can host playoff games and be a number one seed. But can you get to the Super Bowl with uh, a guy who isn't an elite uh, Hall of Fame type quarterback? It's very, very rare. You got to have superior things elsewhere. Uh, you know, maybe one of the best defenses of all time. See Jim McMahon, even though he made his plays in 85, but, you know, that one single season, you know, Monsters of the Midway defense, for example, or the Ravens defense. You had Trent Dilfer, you had Brad Johnson with the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Those are just a few small examples. Even Doug Williams, who's not in the Hall of Fame, was unbelievable for the Redskins in the 80s. He was one of the top couple of quarterbacks that uh, given season. And, and, and look, this Tannehill situation, not good for the Titans, but the Bengals, is they're the story. Uh, being able to do incredible things at the end of that game. They get the ball with 20 seconds left. Joe Burrow, ice in his veins. What a sling throw to the sideline on the right there to chase. They get it up a little bit, and, uh, and McPherson kicks a, a, a ball, which was, what, 52 yards. Uh, just a remarkable finish, a great win for Cincinnati. I'm super happy for them. And now this. If the Bills win tomorrow in Kansas City... The AFC Championship game goes through Buffalo, New York. Mike Lindsley with you here. ML Sports Take brought to you by Chick-fil-A of Cicero and Clay, Welching Company Jewelers, the Vince Aguirre Consulting Group, and your State Farm agent, Matt Graham. Get a free rate quote today from Matt at SyracuseInsuranceAgent.com. Hit me on Twitter at Mike L Sports. As I always tell you, enjoy the games.